Thank you all for being here tonight. It's a pleasure for me to be here as well. But uh, more than everything, I'm very glad that you're here because, you know, we could have done for the launching of Piper or relaunching of Piper in Trinidad a, a big party and stuff. But instead of that, we decided to carefully select a few people of Trinidad and you're the ones. And, and we did that because we have a different philosophy at Piper. Uh, we're kind of a bold champagne house. We don't do the same thing like the others. We don't like people to tell us what we have to drink, how we have to do our champagnes. And the results are great. You know, we have been elected the most awarded champagne house of the century. Uh, so the results are here, but we do the things very different from the others. And we think that you also do things a bit different from the others. You don't let the big brands dictate what you have to wear, what you have to drink, what you have to do. So that's why you're Welcome here tonight and I'm glad that you answered positively to this invitation. So thank you for that. Welcome to another episode of Showtime TT and I'm super, super excited and super delighted because today it's all about the champagne tasting. It's all about Piper Heidzik. I'm here with uh, Philippe. So, Philippe, tell me a little bit about Piper Heidzik. Uh, Piper Heidzik champagne, it's more than 240 years of experience, uh, founded in 1785. Um, I'm very glad to be here tonight. Thank you for welcoming on the show. Um, and yeah, the idea is to talk to you about these lovely champagnes and what we're launching today special uh, in Trinidad. And tell me about the launch today though, because I mean, we talked a little bit about the new labeling and new packaging, so tell me about the new launch. So, well, at Piper Heidzig, we're kind of bold, so we like to do the things a bit different from the other champagne uh, houses. So the idea uh, here is to create a different kind of bottle, but also a different kind of way of promoting it. So we're not chasing the traditional drinker of champagne, but more the upper millennial that, you know, define himself what he wants to, to drink, what he wants to eat. He's not following all the rules of the big companies and the commercial things. So that's a bit the spirit of boldness of Piper Heights. And I like what you told me about the hyphen. A dash of seduction. I love that tagline. Tell me about that because, I mean, it really sells itself. It's champagne. I mean, you don't need much, but tell me about that hyphen. Um, so, as you can notice, Piper Heidsick is the combination of two names, Piper and Heidsick. And so all the spirit about Piper Heidsick is this dash, this link between uh, drink and food with drink and, and cinema as you know we're the official sponsor of the Oscars and so the dash of seduction is all the about what is champagne it's having a glass with someone you love or you like and you want to share some good time so it's a link between those two people and you can uh, decline it in different ways mm -hmm. and tell me about you launching in this half of the world in the Caribbean launching the champagne so tell me about that journey it's, it's a long journey. You can imagine that champagne takes a lot of time. Just this bottle, which is the boat, it takes three years at least to produce. Wow. So the journey began a long time ago. And to reach Trinidad, it's a long way also on the boat and stuff. But we're very happy so to, to bring it to all the parts of the world and, to, and to, yeah, to, to present what is a different champagne in a way and the spirit of Piper. And for people that don't know out there that might know, if it's not made in the village, as you were telling me, if it's not made in the village of Champagne in France, then it's not Champagne, right? So explain that to some people out there that might not know and might not understand. So as we say in French, ne de Champagne que de Champagne. So only comes and only is Champagne from the Champagne area. So anything produced outside of the Champagne area, which is the grape or the bottling, cannot be called Champagne. You heard it right here, Showtime TT. It's all about Piper Heidzik. Piper Heidzik, everybody. Heidzik. Uh, yes. Salud. All right, crew. Tell me how we feeling this Piper Heidzik. This is the um, Cuvée Sublime. The Cuvée Sublime. How are you feeling this one? 
It isn't very good. I like it a lot. I'm ready for next class. Ah, okay. What about you? It's Cuvée Sublime. It's a Cuvée Sublime. Cuvée Sublime. Uh -huh. Piper Isaac. Piper Isaac. I love it. It tastes wonderful. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Pronunciation on point there, guys. He got it. Piper Isaac. Piper Isaac. Okay, what about you, ma'am? How are you feeling? It? I like it. It's crisp. It's fresh. It's not too dry. Nice on the palate. I like it. I couldn't say it better myself, guys. She said nice on the palate. That's one thing about the Piper Isaac. Very, very delicate. Very smooth. Catch yourself a bottle. What about you, ma'am? How are you feeling this one? This one is really Oopsie. good. <laughs> this one is good. We thought the rosé was the better one. We had that one before, but this one is, yeah, it's a little, yeah, it's better than the rosé actually. Tonight we are talking about uh, some of the wonderful brands that we have. This is the um, Cuvée Sublime. Cuvée Sublime. This, so this is the, the the one you're drinking tonight. It's the Cuvée Sublime. The, Excuse me, this one, the Cuvée Sublime, which is a demi-sex or semi-sweet, so I, I guess That's you like it. That's why I love it. <laughs> then you have also the Brut, which is a, a more traditional champagne in a way. And finally, the Rosé Sauvage, so the white Rosé, yeah. which is the one I have in my hands. And I had the pleasure and opportunity of also sampling uh, uh, the Rosé Sauvage. I must say... It's great. It's great on the palate. I really enjoyed it. I'm really, <laughs> I'm absolutely enjoying the champagne tasting tonight. And tell me what, what you all have planned for the future, 2018 and beyond. Where's Piper Heizik going to go? Um, well, we're present almost in more than 100 countries. So the idea now is to focus on the communication inside of those countries. And um, yeah, maybe more, more present on all these upper millennial uh, people, really making them like the product, taste the product and, and fall in love with our philosophy. And you think that Trinidad and Tobago, we've accepted the culture of champagne. You think we're high champagne drinkers? Yes, you are, and, <laughs> and especially, well, you know, you, you're a event and party people, so that's what we like to do. Uh, in Barbados, we do a lot of events, and that's what we, I try to bring here also. We want to go to that side and to, you know, champagne is fun. It's not all only classic and class, so we, we have to, to bring that part also of champagne. Okay, so how are you enjoying your uh, Rosé Sauvage tonight? It's a really nice blend, um, not too sweet, not too dry, so it really tastes nice. All right, she wants more. What about you? How are you enjoying this one? I find it very palatable, it tastes nice, and I don't really like dry stuff, but it's going on real cool. I totally agree, but let's take a sip now. Yeah, for real. Uh -huh. <laughs> what about you, Carla? How about you? Um, yeah, I like it. Well, I don't like sweet. Okay. So for me, this is good because it's not too sweet and it's not that dry either. All right, so let's take a quick drink, everybody. Cheers. Yeah. Cheers. Woo. Yeah, man. <laughs> All right, so we're talking about a dash of seduction. We're talking about Piper Heidzik, and I am in love, 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 love with the taste. I'm having a good time. You only to get a bottle. It's your second. But I mean, you were touching on Carnival and I did ask you. You haven't been here. But tell me about the collaboration with uh, Piper Heidzik and uh, Lime TT, the event that is shown. Yes, so we're the partner of the Lime Fets. Uh, so we're very glad to be here. So <laughs> that's why I, I know that next year I will be part of that party. Yeah. Um, and you know, it's not the only party we do. We do a lot of activity. Our color is the red color. So what does it mean for you, the red color? Red royalty. Exactly. The red carpet also, you know, the glamour side. So this is uh, what we like. And we're the, the official sponsor of the Oscars or the... Film Festival, so we do a lot of things around the cinema universe and, and all this glamour side. All right, nice. And tell me about where we can get these products uh, regionally and locally right here in Trinidad and Tobago. Where can we get it? So we're working here with Atco, who's our distributor here in the island. So you will have to, to, to well, in the main chains, you can find the, the product as well. And uh, if you have more questions, you can go and ask to ask where you can find the product. Most definitely. I love you. So he's 
so precise. I absolutely love it. And tell me about uh, Trinidad. Uh, you want to give me some French lessons? Yeah. So let's just let's just say something in French real quick. So I'm drinking the best champagne in the world. Piper Isaac. How do I say that? Vous êtes en train de boire le meilleur champagne au monde, Piper Isaac. Santé, madame. Salut. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you. Yeah, that was, that was perfect. I, I couldn't repeat that at all. I'm glad we drank after that. Yes, I could not. I could not repeat that. But thanks so much for being here and for doing this interview with us, Showtime TT. We really, really appreciate it. Uh, I'm going to be having a lot of this. Some Piper Heizik. I'm loving this demi sec. What about you? Good. The Rosé Sauvage is very well as well. Huh? So enjoy all the cans you want. Pop Costa Piper with these magnums, quite a lot, will be opening 1,500 bottles of champagne. Yes, we know how you like to pop bottles. So there you go. The official champagne of the Academy Awards is Piper Heitzig, and they've created this gorgeous um, tation. This is what all the stars will be drinking. Show time to party. First stop, the governor's ball. This is the official after party.